Nishi, thank you so much for inviting us to be here with you this I'm evening. happy to be here. Welcome. Well, thank you. I just want to start off by saying congratulations on your success. Not oh, only, thank you. Yeah, not only just as a mayor, but also just being an individual who is an advocate for positive change and also promoting active citizenship. Yeah, thank you for saying. One thing I really appreciated was when you uh, started, um, I remember after your campaign, you started Three Things for Calgary. Mm -hmm. And you challenged Calgarians to do at least three things for the city to make it a better city to be in. Now, that would mean that over three million people would be making a difference in our city. Three million different acts of giving, yeah. So tell us, what made you start Three Things for Calgary? Well, you know, during the 2010 election, people got really excited about the election, but more important than that, about the future of the city. And so once I was elected, I thought to myself, how are we going to keep that energy up between elections that we saw during the election? So I pulled together this group of super volunteers, and I said, guys, figure out how we're going to get more people involved and engaged in their city. And it took them 30 days to come up with a name for their committee. 30 days? The Mayor's Committee on Civic Engagement, worst name they could ever have come up with. But uh -huh. a few days after that, they came up with this idea, Three Things for Calgary. And you know, when they told me, I thought, guys, this is crazy. It is simultaneously too simple and too complicated. Right? It's too simple because we're not telling people what to do. We're not giving them ideas of how they can contribute to the community. And it's too complicated because we're making people do three things. But it actually turned out those two things were precisely why it's successful. Everyone gets to choose what they feel they can do, what's important to them, what capacity they have, what they've got in their own hands to be able to make change. So some people do big things. They take on a new volunteer role, join a community association. Some people do small ones. You know, the people who realize that parents who have to take their kids to the Alberta Children's Hospital emerge in the middle of the night will never remember to pack a toothbrush. So they collected toothbrushes for the emergency room at the Children's Hospital. What a great, simple idea. Oh, that's awesome. And I love these sorts of things. I love the guy who said he was going to have a barbecue, but he was going to do it in his front yard instead of his backyard and invite all his neighbors on his street that he never really met. These are all the kinds of things that build community, and that's one of the reasons why it's so exciting. Well, you know what? I congratulate you on all your success, and I think you know what you're doing at Three Things for Calgary is amazing. I also want for viewers that may be watching today to also go to the website, yeah. threethingsforcalgary.ca. Three so lastly, you know our show and our mission is really to discuss issues that challenge and interest young people, mm -hmm. and uh, our goal is really to empower young people Fantastic. in our city. So what's Ninchi's message to young people in well, our city? Well, you know, I think the message to young people is the message to everyone, which is the future of your community is in your own hands. Don't rely on government or business or nonprofits to make your community better. And don't think, I'm too young, I don't have enough money, I come from an ethnic minority, who's going to listen to me? All of those are excuses. Because as I always say, nobody is too young, nobody is too small, nobody is too weak, nobody's voice is too silent to be able to make real change in their community. It's in your hands, in your mind, in your heart, in your soul to be able to do it. Whether you agree with what's happening or disagree, it's up to you to make the community better. Well said. And that's our mayor, Mayor Nancy. Thank you so much. Thank you. We appreciate it. Thank you.